Good morning, welcome to Green VI. We are a non-profit glass blowing studio located here in Cane Garden Bay. We've been here for a little over a year raising awareness for the need to recycle here in the British Virgin Islands. Our mission here at Green BI for recycling is collecting the waste stream beer bottles here in Cane Garden Bay produced from the bars and restaurants. We do have bins per color. We have uh, clear and green and we, uh, we use license plates and putty knives to scrape the labels off. This is part of the process of um, a bottle being clean. So like a scraping of labels. We have these bottles there soaking overnight. That helps soften up the label. So I'm thinking I'll license plate. Next to sell a piece. I'm just trying to clean these bottles up. And then hand break the bottles with protective eyewear on. Um, to break it down into smaller little chunks. My hands typically we have gloves on as well. And that's as small as it has to be broken down, um, just broken, shattered pieces. And so then that raw material gets literally shoveled into the glass furnace inside the studio and that holds about 200 pounds of glass and that is one of these boxes almost completely full to the top. Currently we have two men that are full-time apprentices here at the studio. Pedro and Lion that have been working with us closely learning the techniques and trades of the glass blowing industry. So we just take molten glass out of the furnace and it's pretty much, a, it's just like the consistency of honey right now so it just drips onto the table and then we can cut that free. I'll switch with Pedro and we can stick the bowl right on there close to center as we can. And so you can start to see the colors come out in that. And then we take another heat to heat the bowl up and kind of bond the two together. So here at the studio we have three main pieces of equipment. We have a 200 pound furnace that was an old gas storage tank that we rescued out of Pockwood Pond. We put a 200 pound ceramic crucible inside, lined it with some insulatory brick and fiber. We take hot molten glass out of our furnace with our stainless steel blowpipes and we start to transform this trash into a treasure. I blew into that a quick burst of air and then I capped the blowpipe with my thumb and so then Trapping the air inside the pipe and then the heat from the pipe made that air expand. And that's just a trick that we use to get the bubble started. I'm swinging this out to elongate it using gravity and centrifugal force. We'll stretch the cup. Okay. Can you grab that other mug and bring it over? We're just going to size these up. Okay, Garrett, you want to make the handle and Pedro, you watch how he does it. And then tap the tip. Okay, that's too fast. <laughs> Typically, I roll it first. That'll work. Okay, heat it up. That's how we make the beer mug. Go ahead and stamp it, Pedro. Once the product is finished, it goes away as a final form into our annealing oven where it is cooled overnight to alleviate the stress buildup from moving from a liquid to a solid so quickly. Our clients here at Green VI are the community at large that live here on Tortola along with the visitors on island, whether it's cruise ship or charter boat people. They have all been extremely supportive in the cause to see that recycling is established here on island. 
by purchasing our products, they are supporting us in our mission. We are staying alive from our sponsorship um, help. We have over 35 sponsors right now that have helped us in some form or fashion. And without our sponsors, we would not be here currently. You can find all our information at greenvi.org and we would be more than willing to show you the positives and negatives to the recycling process here in the BBIs.